This is my review, my newly purchased Futuba 3PM MX 2.4 GHz sport radio for an RC color boat. Here's the box, I just opened it. It's a nice box. It is made in Taiwan. Directions, nice manual. The radio comes in uh, a styrofoam box. You get some uh, decals, quantity sheet. Um, yeah, this would be for a, um, I guess like a nitro car with a battery pack. It does not include. It came with free servo, S300 or 3004. S304 servo, so that's neat. I just installed it. The receiver is very small. I just uh, replaced it with um, one of these radios, an old JR XR3. Works perfect and all, but it's uh, not compatible with this brushless system I put on, which is basically a stock uh, SC10 two-wheel drive setup with the motor and the ASP control. Um, yeah, it's an old RC10 T3. Got SC10 over there. Um, turn on the radio. Your power switch right here. Turns on. Oh, I gotta plug in my uh, connectors. So I can do this one-handedly. Hold on. Okay, we're in. Turn that on. Get a green LED in your uh, receiver. Back of the module. Also has a, uh, I mean the transmitter, has a uh, green LED. Which lets you know that it's uh, active. Go through the menus in this particular controller. Basically just hit the select button right here. And it changes. And it changes from steering to throttle. You just press channel. Brake, steering. Said you that wasn't throttle selection, but a couple of them are. I had to um, reverse the steering and the throttle function because it was um, opposite. Remember, I had an older uh, Futuba Magnum Sport radio. I had to do the same thing with the high tech servo and this uh, same truck. So now it works perfect. Turn the wheels. What would that be? That's on. Um, turn the wheels right. Right, left, left. Throttle works. Brake and reverse work. So we're all set. Not too sure what the uh, the whole three channel. I mean the third channel. How that whole uh, deal functions. And uh, that's about it. Battery trays in the bottom. Opens up real nice. I'm just using the alkaline batteries. You see can replace that with a rechargeable pack if you want and the uh, charging ports right back over there but it's a nice little radio I got it for a uh, pretty good price compared to what they're going for Ten of folds down for storage and uh, it's not bad I like it this came with a couple little scratches over there I'm not happy about but it is what it is so that's my review Nice little radio. It works well in this truck. And it fixed its glitching problem that I had with the FM with the brushless setup. Now I, when I give it full throttle, it just takes off before we glitch really bad. So uh, that's it. Look forward to another video when I uh, have this thing running around. And I'll be upgrading my other uh, vehicle to an Airtronics radio. So I'll have a review of that up too.